YouTube this is another makeup basket video and I am going to be showing you what I will be using this week and I just pushed this I am gonna this is just like really random I picked this up from um I picked this up from Lowe's yesterday it's just like a, a paint sample like a you can paint like five feet of your um room to see if you like it and this is the um, radiant orchid pantone universe color paint i want to see if i want this paint on my walls in here i'm sick of this like gold color paint but um anyway that is not what the video is about i am showing you what i will be using this week in they have a line around my lips. I can't stand that. And I feel like I do. Anyway, um what I have on my lips is a the MAC lip pencil in the color magenta and Milani um color statement lipstick in the color rose hip. So that is what I have on my lips. But let's get started with what I will be using this week. And since I have this in my hand, I have not painted my nails yet, but I will be using one of the Revlon Spider-Man Collection nail polishes. And this is in the color Spidey Sense. I don't know if you can see that, but this is what the polish looks like. This was one of the most unique colors that I saw in that collection. The other, other ones sort of look like stuff that I already saw. This one looks sort of like a reddish orange color with some little small gold um, glitter in it. So I'm going to be using that on my nails this week. Uh, let's get started for eyeshadows. I am actually going to break out some of my old um, MAC eyeshadows. And I will pick those out for you. Mostly doing... Um, neutral looks this week so I will I'll show you the match shadows I'm going to be using and the first one is rice paper which is like the first ever MAC eyeshadow that I ever bought of course this is not the same one but rice paper I am going to be using woodwinked which looks like a muted gold color and I love this as a lid color so woodwinked which is a of Velux Pearl rice paper is a frost. Um, I am going to be using Amber Lights, which is another favorite, which is also a frost. Um, and two browns. Actually, I'm going to be in a. It's probably in my little basket over there. Using Saddle also as a transition color, but I'm going to be using Handwritten and also embark so those are the five neutral um, MAC eyeshadows I'll be using this week I am going to be using two of my um, wet n wild palettes the first one will be walking on eggshells so this is walking on eggshells and then this one was a limited edition I can't remember even when this one came out this is called the gilded age so as you can see, I will be very neutral this week. Um, I am also going to be using the Kat Von D Ladybird palette, which looks like that. And these are the colors on the inside. Also pretty neutral. And it comes with a little eyeliner in the color Immortal. Immortal Love. A little brown color eyeshadow. So those are the eye products that I will be using this week. Um, I am also going to be using, and I just did a video on it, which will probably be up before this one, the Bare Minerals Bare Skin Foundation in the color Bare Walnut. have it on my face today, but I want to use it and kind of test it out this week and see how I like it. Um, I'm going to be using the Sleek Face Contour Kit, and I have it in the color Medium. going to venture into some colored mascara this one I have had for a while but have never used 
and this is the Maybelline Great Lash Mascara and this was a limited edition it's in the color blink of blue so we will be having blue eyelashes along with our neutral eyeshadow this week um, also Tarte's Light Scammer Lashes I think I'll probably first coat second coat I'm not sure we'll see how I can make the blue kind of pop um, oh for my brows is which what I use today I'm going to be using the Avon eyebrow per Avon perfect eyebrow pencil and it's just a, like a regular pencil that you sharpen and it has the little spoolie on the other end of it and I forgot how much I liked this until I pulled it back out yesterday um for blushes I think I pulled out like four of them and the first one I do have on today and that is by, it's by the balm and it is the cabana boy blush and it looks like this so it's like a soft pink color on my cheeks I am also going to be going to be using a cream blush and this is from flower beauty and it looks like that me pop it open it is in the color Elegant Azalea and it looks like that. I am going to be using two NYX blushes. One of them is just for sort of a glow and it is in the color Terracotta. Actually both of them are sort of glowy. The other one is in the color Pinched and Pinched looks like this. So those are my blushes. Um, oh, I also have, and I got this, I don't know if I talked about this already, during the 15% um, off sale at Sephora, the Hourglass, it's very reflective, ambient lighting blush, and I got it in the color Diffused Heat. I used this a couple of times last week, and I really like it. It is very deceiving when you swatch it because it looks powdery, but it sort of warms up when you put it on your cheeks. Um, another thing I picked up, which I probably would never have bought if it was not on the 15%, is the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powder. And this one is in the color Radiant Light. Also really pretty on, but deceiving when you swatch it because it looks powdery and white. But when you put it on your skin, it just gives your skin a nice, soft, natural glow. So, I like that. Um, concealer this week. I am going to be using the LA Girl Pro Conceal HD High Definition Concealer in the color Fawn. I broke this up because I haven't used this in a while. Um, I have one, two, three, and actually now four lip colors let me grab the other one once. okay three of the lip colors are from Maybelline I think two of them were in my basket last week and these are the Maybelline elixirs um, I am going to be using them in the color blush essence which is this color here um, raspberry rhapsody which is this color here and then in the color caramel infused which is this color here. Um, I have one BH Cosmetics lipstick and this one is in the color Charmed and I'll show you the actual lipstick. Looks like that. And then a Too Faced, what do they call these? I don't know what they call them but it's a Too Faced um, lipstick and it is in the color I want candy and it looks like that uh, I did oh, good I did pick another one of my MAC eyeshadow I mean paint pots I don't want to say eyeshadow base paint pots and this one is in the color laying low which is just a little bit warmer than the one that I used last week and it looks like this on the inside and you all that is it I still have my um, Anastasia dip brow, dip brow pomade in here because I'm still trying it out I have it in the color chocolate 
so I may be intermixing that not intermixing but either using that or the Avon pencil this week but that is it that is what is in my makeup basket slash lunch box for this week thank you all for watching have a good day bye